Hello, <coughs> my name is Steve Walker. I am uh, residing in District 17, and uh, many of you have had uh, uh, copies of uh, what I was prepared to give, so I will shorten it right now and cut to the chase. Uh, I'm a former state archivist of the state, and as state archivist, I was charged with protecting and making accessible the Constitution of the state of Idaho. Uh, I've been fortunate to handle each and every page of it, and have read it all. And I've looked at a document that I think is even more precious, and that's the draft Constitution. I've seen uh, uh, it's all of its cross-outs, addition, pasted in change of language, and I got to see how carefully the final document was uh, crafted. Where the U.S. Constitution had to be amended for a Bill of Rights, uh, and amendments have been uh, rescinded, as in the Prohibition. The Idaho Constitution went <coughs> way beyond the U.S. Constitution and put the Declaration of Rights as Article One of its Constitution. It uh, lists goes uh, lists 22 specific rights. Uh, many of what you've heard, uh, Section 10, about the right to assembly. Section 2 states that all political powers inherent in the people. Uh, Section 1 states of inalienable rights. I'm fortunate I live in Boise and can come down here without too much di difficulty to testify. I'm fortunate I live in a district where my elected representatives make themselves readily available to the constituents. Many of my friends in the movement do not feel as fortunate. They wish to peacefully assemble, consult for the common good, instruct the representative, representatives, and petition this legislature for the redress of grievances. Since some of your members have told me with pride that this body is more deliberative, deliberative than the body across the hall, I hope this is true. <laughs> Think about our Idaho Constitution and what it means to the people's right of assembly if this bill is rushed through. There is no emergency. It is the quick reaction to a movement that many don't understand and a few may fear. Please be deliberative. Consider the care that was put into the creation of Idaho's Constitution. Please consider all the consequences. Uh, this bill was rushed into action and not well thought out. Please vote down this bill, or at least throw out the emergency provision, and give the people a chance to be heard. Thank you for your Thank time. Thank you very much. Uh, Monica Hopkins and then Jan Sylvester. 